Hey guys, quick back Mr. Basics here. Let's talk about Western blot. Western blot is a molecular biology technique used to detect specific proteins in the given sample. In this method, the proteins present in the sample are first denatured by heating them in boiling water bath for few minutes. Once denatured, the proteins are separated by SDS page. After the separation is complete, the proteins present in the gel are transferred to a special membrane known as PVDF membrane. There are two ways in which this transfer is done. Number one, by placing the membrane directly on the gel and stacking filter papers on the top along with some weight. This entire set is then placed in buffer solution. As the buffer solution moves up Due to capillary action, the proteins also move upwards and finally gets attached on the membrane. Number 2. The second method used for the transfer is electroblotting. In this method, the PVDF membrane is placed on the gel and sandwiched between filter papers. This whole set is then transferred to electrophoresis tank. When the electric field is applied, the protein moves towards the positively charged electrodes and get transferred on the membrane. The next step is to detect our desired protein using an antibody. However, an antibody can also bind the membrane. Hence, to avoid this non-specific binding, we need to block the membrane. This is done by treating the membrane with dilute BSA or milk protein along with mild detergents. These proteins bind other part of membrane except the region where the protein bands are present. This process is known as blocking of membrane. Once the membrane is blocked, it is treated with an antibody that specifically binds our desired protein. This is known as primary antibody. In order to detect binding of primary antibody, we use secondary antibody. The secondary antibody is attached with a reporter enzyme that converts a substrate into a colored product which can easily be detected.